if you absolutely have determined that you must see someone who is not in network with your plan, then uh, then you can appeal request for there to be a uh, authorization for the out of network provider to be reimbursed at a higher rate. But what I always tell families is it's not a matter of preference the plan is really not going to give you someone out of network at a higher rate of reimbursement because you prefer them. You have to show that it is medically necessary, that it's the plan's obligation because there is no one in network who is qualified and available to provide that service. If you call every OT or every developmental pediatrician or every person on your child's plan and either they're not doing peds or they're booked out for a year, the, or they don't have the specific uh, subspecialty or the specific training that your child needs in their team member, you can advocate uh, for increased reimbursement, but it has to be more than a preference. It has to, if the plan is going to up their reimbursement, you have to prove to them that there's no way you can work in network. So that can be done. Uh, some plans, it's simpler than other plans, uh, but uh, it is not a one day job, but it certainly can be done if you identify that core thing that is not available and is essential for your child uh, in the network contracted list. 